for AM5 builders, enthusiasts, and gamers alike, this is the motherboard for you. And today, we have one of those to show to you. It's Asus' newest motherboard to pair with the newly launched AM5 socket and AMD's Ryzen 7000 series. Plus, we'll explain to you the different options and chipsets for the other motherboards so you can make an informed decision. All right, we have Asus ROG Crosshair X670E Hero, and it's one of their newest motherboards with the Extreme chipset. The Hero is accessible to new builders and to those who want to take advantage of the new hardware bump this AM5 generation has to offer. Asus has many more motherboards catered towards different types of creators or gamers out there. First off, there are two chipsets, X670 and the X670E which we have right here. The X670E, which denotes extreme, indicates that it's full of Gen 5 features on board, such as having an array of next-gen connectivity, such as PCIe 5.0, DDR5, USB 4, and Wi-Fi 6E. But as we said, the Hero is the more accessible option in their extreme lineup, bridging the gap a little closer between professional PC builders and enthusiast gamers. And since we got one today, we'll do a quick unboxing and impressions of the new motherboard. We wanna thank Asus for providing us a sample unit so we can create this video and share with you what we found so interesting about the new generation of motherboards. Ooh, I get to unbox it. <laughs> Don't let me! All right, now to unbox this. So now I have my special gloves on and Let's see what it looks like inside. All right. So here you can see, for those who dare, Republic of Gamers. Ooh, okay, so this does look very premium. All right, let's take this motherboard out and see what we're working with today. Whew. Okay, damn, look at this. Ooh, okay, so this is the new expansion that we we're talking about later in the video. Um, so we can get a quick little sneak peek of it. There. So the rest is actually just instructions and manuals, and I believe, if I can see here, this is actually a sticker plate. So, for all those sticker fanboys, we are covered. They actually look really cool if you look at it. Look at these cool designs. It makes it look like kind of like this bio mecha transformers type of look. Um, I think it's dope. All right, let's get this out of the way and look at the motherboard. The ROG Crosshair X670E Hero and the others in the lineup feature dark hues that dominate the surface of the motherboard. Not only does it provide an intense backdrop for your colorful builds, but there's a little bit of lighting here that gives a compliment to your RGB or solid color builds. The poly mode display across this integrated IO shield makes it really pop if you want it or not. It's still customizable through the software, so you can change up the color scheme and the design to better suit your build and style. It also supports Asus Aorus Sync, but of course, you can turn it off for more of a standard look. The finish on the shield here is somewhat like a darkened mirror with a polished surface, so it really makes it pop. So time for the most important part. It's not only the CPU socket that received an upgrade from AM4 to AM5, but the newest motherboards support the latest DDR5 RAM. The X670E Hero and the other models in the Extreme lineup are the ones that are really pushing the boundary. Asus has really helped on many PC enthusiasts' ability to have more flex and unparalleled capability to take their machines to a whole nother level. The new X670E and X670 has PCIe 5.0, which doubles the link speed of PCIe 4.0, which has helped Asus in enabling USB 4, USB 3.2, Gen 2 ports, all the newest motherboards. The X670E Hero has two PCIe 5.0 slots and a by 16 layout, or eight by eight if you so choose. There's also standard PCIe 4.0 lane. You can use the by 16 PCIe 5.0 slot for graphic cards, or you can use the included PCIe 5.0 M.2 card, which will give you a third M.2 slot in addition to the two onboard slots. This way, you can dissipate the heat in a full size 22 110 drive from the bigger surface area. Products with this many options are rarely seen, especially in a motherboard. That's how you can tell that Asus is really listening to your feedback. Since we're talking about the interfaces of a motherboard, Asus has really made the hassle of building your own PC a thing of the past. Their Q release or quick release system for PCIe slots features a one finger push latch on one side of the PCIe slot for easy release of whatever cards you have added, making installation, disassembly of your PC build easy breezy. 
No more fitting your stubby fingers or asking a little nephew to push the release on your motherboard. This is a feature that is widely available for the latest Asus motherboards, and they now have it on the latest X670 series. You can find the same mechanism for RAM and graphic card slots with their QDIM latching design. It also doesn't get in the way of your graphic cards, making it much easier to upgrade and install your RAM in the future. You can see the pattern here, right? Asus designers have made everything much easier for these new AM5 motherboards. Remember trying to tighten a tiny screw without a magnetic screwdriver for your SSD? Only for it to fall in some tiny crevice you'll never find again? Asus has done it again. They've made the Q-latch for even your SSDs. It only requires your fingers to tighten. The SSD base also come with dual-sided heat sinks for those beefier high-density, two terabyte SSDs that have memory on both sides. Now that we take a look in general about the Hero, I think some of you are really wondering what's gonna be some amazing highlights of this board. The new AM5 chip, depending on which one you get, has a TDP of up to 170 watts. With all that power, it needs proper cooling. With great power comes great responsibility. Rest assured, you can adapt your AM4 coolers to the AM5. The Hero bears the same mounting hole alignment as the AM4 platforms so it is backwards compatible with your existing coolers. There'll be less than one millimeter in difference between the old and for the new chip. Asus and AMD has stated that the new AM5 motherboards are expected to be supported through 2025 and beyond. As motherboards are the core of a PC, they're usually the last thing that people want to upgrade time and time again. So you don't need to worry. You'll see many, many years of the use of the AM5 socket and motherboard you choose to buy. Not only that, but Asus has developed AI Cooling 2 for the entire X670 and X670E lineup. AI Cooling 2 is a tool found in Asus Armory Crate app, and it can be enabled through Fan Expert. It uses machine learning to gather data about your system's build during a brief stress test. From then on, the AI Cooling will monitor your CPU and it'll use the data from previous stress tests that it ran to calculate the lowest fan speed required to effectively cool your system while keeping noise levels low. This adaptive fan speed can reduce your computer's fan noise by up to five and a half decibels under sustained loads. Underneath the aluminum IO shield are bigger than before VRM heat sinks and heat pipes to really dissipate the heat from your new AM5 chip and for your performance demands. If you're someone who really loves to overclock, you'll find this really helpful. The X670E is built for extreme overclocking. So there's more of a manual overclocking. And then there's AMD CPUs that come with a built-in overclock feature called Precision Boost Overdrive, or PBO. Well, Asus is helping out with both, and it's called Dynamic OC Switcher. It automatically switches between the two modes of PBO and your manual set overclock to give you the best performance for the task at hand. After you set your manual overclock for heavy tasks, you can select a threshold for the dynamic OC switcher to activate. From that point on, you basically don't need to worry, as it dynamically switches from PBO to your manual overclock automatically. For those who enjoy a high-end music listening experience with FLAC and other lossless codecs, there's also an audiophile grade DAC built in to pump out the best sound quality to match your high-end audio equipment. Of course, Asus is including the latest Wi-Fi 6 technology in these motherboards. Pair together with the Asus Rapture router and you'll be sailing the high seas above everyone else on the Wi-Fi spectrum. And there you have it. And that's what we found new and exciting about the Asus X670E Hero AM5 motherboard. You can get your new AM5 motherboards at Canon Computers today. And as always, be sure to leave a like, subscribe, and don't forget to hit that bell notification so you don't miss out on any of our new videos.